Yo, with the news here on Headlines today with me, Shiv Arur. A new mobile video showing angry airline passengers shooing off one of Pakistan's most prominent politicians, Rehman Malik, from a delayed Pakistan International Airlines flight leaving Karachi for the capital Islamabad last evening has gone completely viral. Let's just play out for you what happened when Rehman Malik arrived over two hours late for a flight. And here's how passengers reacted. I tell you what, when Rahman Malik comes here, I will tell him to get onto the microphone and apologize to the passengers. I will tell him to get onto the microphone and apologize to the passengers. I will tell him to get onto इसको करना पड़ना नहीं आता सही वो क्या करेगा यार अबे आप वो तो यूज़ करते हैं। How long will we put up with this nonsense in this country? How long? साढ़े पांच बजे का आपका मैसेज है मैं गाड़ी में था नहीं था मेरे को आपका ये ही है। आपका मैसेज है। Your flight is on time। आप शराय फैसल पे पसंद हैं। my foot VIPs here. इनको तो भाई भी ग्रिल करता हूँ। इनको मैं ग्रिल करता हूँ। Don't you worry. आप भी ये I'm sure when he comes in. We're not taking it anymore. Are we going to take it for another 68 years? Aage, 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 aage. Our flight delay, who is it? Who is it? Flight delay. Assalamu alaikum. Sorry, sorry. Sorry, Malik Saab, sorry. Malik Saab, you should go back. You should apologize to these fabs. Yes, you should. You should be ashamed of yourself. Rahman Malik Saab, die for passenger. I'm sorry. I am sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. They're all coming out. Because of you, it is your fault, sir. It is your fault, sir. I am sorry. Malik Saab, you are not a minister anymore. You are not a minister anymore. And even if you are a minister, we don't care. We don't care anymore. We don't care anymore. You people have to become humans. You have to get down to now. I am Zameen Bhutre. Zameen Bhutre. Well, the former Pakistan Interior Minister responded on Twitter denying that the plane was delayed because of him. He said that there was a technical error as a result of which he had to arrive late. He's clarified on Twitter, but this is a video that's gone completely viral, depicting massive anger on board flight PK370 from Karachi to Islamabad last evening. That video has gone completely viral and it depicts many passengers, at least 50 passengers, furious and frustrated barring entry to former interior minister Rehman Malik throwing him and another politician who followed him off the plane for daring to assume that it was okay to arrive two hours late for a flight from Karachi to Islamabad. Earlier we spoke to Pakistani journalist Tariq Peevzada about this as well. This is the arrogance, the elitism, the sense that they, the rest of the country is a second, uh, is a country of second, uh, second class citizens, and the very fact, and we don't need any argument, uh, what caused the delay, the very fact that the ex-minister showed, because he enjoys so much power in the, in the province of Sindh in particular, because it is the power, the people's party that runs the provincial government, in the province of Sindh. So these people still enjoy a lot of clout. Uh, in, the, in this case, against 270 passengers of the plane, make the plane wait for their, uh, you know, the, for, for them. And the reason that he showed up two and a half hours late of, of, uh, after the time for which the flight was scheduled, that proves that the flight was delayed because of his late arrival. So he was rightly stopped. And I think the plane should have been allowed to, uh, you know, depart uh, much sooner than that. And and you know what happened to these two officers who stopped Mr. 
इतना रहमान मलिक फ्रॉम बोर्ड इन द प्लेस ऑफिसर्स दे हैव बीन एक्चुअली सस्पेंडेड एट द प्रेजेंट टाइम दिस इज द लेटेस्ट न्यूज एज यू मस्ट हैव ऑल्सो हर्ड दिस दिस इज वन गुड थिंग दैट द मैटर वाज नॉट रिजॉर्टेड टू टू द पॉइंट ऑफ वायलेंस एंड बट बट द बट द एंगर ऑफ द पीपल वाज क्लियर एज यू सॉ इन द वीडियो सो आई थिंक द पीपल रिएक्टेड rightly and this sends a message that the country is changing and there is no tolerance for the violation of law i want to bring in headlines today is hamza amir joining me live from islamabad on this uh, hamza rehman malik really shown his place along with that other uh, you know a politician the mna uh, ramesh kumar uh, vankwania but is this something that has captured the imagination of pakistanis because i can tell you that people here in india it has touched a chord then uh, shiv it actually has uh, it has uh, given a lot of heart to the people who actually feared of uh, were fearful of you know raising their voice or even standing up against strong politicians or strong influential people like rahman malik himself um, it might be a small incident of a, of an airline flight but it should not be forgotten that there are many aspects behind it yes. that actually you know led to what what happened in the in uh, in, in the plane and you have a person who is actually sitting in protest calling for democracy prevail calling for uh, you know a change in pakistan people right now are actually feeling more much more empowered but at the same time what the difficult point is that all of this empowerment also is actually allowing the people to take matters into their own hands mm. and not actually follow the law if there is a law that is violated then there is also a way to challenge what the violation is but but it, but is it likely to be the case that uh, you know airlines and you know other government services are going to be very careful about pandering to vvip self self entitled netas like rehman malik in the future for sure for sure i tell you at at mr rahman malik incident is also related to me also because i interviewed him once and yes. it was an hour late interview so he i had to fly at the next uh, i immediately after the interview he actually made the flight stay yeah and he stopped it for an hour and he said that it i have said it and that at that time he was the interior minister so it actually shows what kind of powers these people enjoy and it's basically pakistan international airline so not only rahman malik or any other person who has been in power let him let him let it be the reason why right now those people have been in protest right. against the government on the same rules they have also enjoyed the same privileges thanks sir thanks hamza for getting us that let's hope that vvip's take note as also services that pander to this entitled culture this vvip culture that is really not certainly not restricted to pakistan we know it so well here in india it's subcontinental really thanks hamza for getting us that